Hello. We've created this video to make it easier for you to configure the central unit and sensors during larger installations with multiple sensors. The Logico 2 system communicates digitally through a CAT5 cable. It is therefore essential that every sensor has a different unique ID number so that the central unit can differentiate from which sensor the information is coming from. The ID numbers must be numerically in order from 1 to 12. Unscrew the cover of the sensor. You set the sensor's ID with the lower row of dip switches marked with a number 2. Dip 3 to dip 6 in this row must be adjusted according to the manual to set the desired ID number. After setting the ID number on the sensor, the sensor is powered on. The ID number of the unit will be shown in the display of the sensors during startup. The procedure for setting the ID of the sensors is the same for both CO2 and O2 sensors. Unscrew the cover of the central unit. On the central unit, you set the number of sensors connected to the system with a dip switch. Dip 1 to dip 4 in this row must be set according to the manual for the number of sensors in the system. After the number of sensors on the central unit has been set, an unit is powered on, the sensors and its values will be displayed on the central unit screen. If you install multiple sensors and horn strobes in a system, you need to be aware of the total power consumption of the installation. As the CAT5 cables are approved to deliver one ampere of power, you might need to install one or more power barriers that separates the system electrically and connect extra power to the system. The power barrier separates the power supplies from each other, but allows communication between the different units. The power consumption of the different components in your installation can be found in the Power Barrier Manual, available on Logico 2's website. According to the International Fire Code, you are expected to ensure that power always is available to the system. In order to be warned if power is disrupted, a Logico 2 power monitor can be installed in the system. The power monitor makes an audible alarm if for any reason power to the system is disrupted. Thank you and stay safe with Logico 2.